Hi, my name is Sun Warren, and today I am going to show you how to paint a peony with red silk. The composition is dynamic with a light pink peony and interesting bold red silk fabric to give a strong contrast to the picture plane. It might look complicated, but I will show you how to take your time and create this powerful, brilliant painting. And I think so, I want to make this area a little more intricate, so I wanted to, I already frisked some of them, but I wanted to make this one. Draw this one. You can see it, I'm just kind of drawing it to make this one a little more interesting. Draw the line, kind of geometric pattern. And when you, uh, when you try this one completely and when you apply red, you are going to see all those details you did. So when you are um, painting around uh, each petal by each petal, uh, keep, uh, only you have to worry about is value. Uh, it's lighter area, go lighter and darker area and darker. Because you don't have to worry too much about at this point the color because you are only using one color, permanent rose. So you cannot go this one darker than permanent rose. So you don't have to worry about being uh, value being too much different. And later, if you want to make darker area, we are going to go this one different way. That's kind of uh, safer to do that that way. It's almost like mistake proof. You don't have to worry this one too much about uh, you know where it's going and where it's not going. I'm looking for a generally bluish tone. I think this whole thing is blue. And instead of making everything the same tone, I will just kind of blend some of the area out. So even blue itself has a light and dark to it. Very light, but it subtle changes. But if you make this one hold, uh, blue all over the place, and you're going to see just kind of flat blue. And sometimes if you wanted to have a little uh, fine detail, sometimes you, you wanted to keep your um, the hard edges. If you just keep constantly blending, so not to blend things out, you're not going to have little detail because it's everything just softens. So sometimes just kind of keep your hard edges. Not a larger area, just a small area. Then it's kind of give you a little wrinkly look. I like this.